The most terrifying force of death comes from the men who wanted to be left alone. They try so very hard to mind their own business. Just leave me alone. I just want to provide for those I love. They resist every impulse to fight back. They swallow their ego and walk away. They make allowances for the pride of others. Despite themselves, they trust in the plan. Plan A, live and let live. Plan B, reasonable discourse. Plan C, overwhelming force, maximum speed and aggression, extreme prejudice. With their resistance comes forced and permanent change. And so the man who wanted to be left alone finally takes up arms, some with their words, others with their fists. And then there are those who take up the armaments of heaven and hell, deed and word, who employ infinite creativity and scouring flame to raise all their enemies until they are but charred memories lost in the abyss. I just wanted to be left alone. With the fires of heaven and hell comes a permanent change. The life they knew is gone. The world they fought for is dead. They know that the fight itself has stolen from them everything they ever would have fought for. Their lives as they have lived them are over. I just wanted to be left alone. When the men who want to be left alone fight back, it is a form of suicide. The man who was is no more. The man who loved, the man who built, the man who obeyed, the man who trusted, that man is dead. I just wanted to be left alone. When the men who just wanted to be left alone take up violence, they fight with unrestrained vengeance against those who forced their hand. They fight with raw hate. They fight with brutality. They fight by any means available to them. And they fight without mercy. I just wanted to be left alone. The great manipulators who pushed them to this who thought themselves so clever, who were merely play-acting at terror and politics, what will they say when true terror arrives at their doorsteps? I just wanted to be left alone, to live my life in peace, but you wouldn't allow it. Go ahead, cry, scream, beg for mercy. My ears are deaf. Only your agony will baptize me into hearing again. I am the man who just wanted to be left alone, and soon you'll wish that you had.